Hi guys. So this is a mini Whole Foods haul. Really, really tiny, because I actually did go to Sprouts, so I'm actually gonna link this with the Sprouts one, which is a little bit bigger. But I did get some cool stuff. Uh, eh, eh, maybe boring stuff. Regular, regular stuff. So they had these at the checkout counter, the Justin's Dark Chocolate Peanut Butter Cups. Organic. I wanted to give those a try. Um, also, being that here in Tennessee, summer is in full effect, even though it's technically still spring. Uh, my son is in some camp. So I thought maybe sending him in with a little treat of peanut butter cup might be cute for his little lunches. And then they had a sale on the organic strawberries. So I got two of them, which I'm going to crack open one because I'm kind of hungry. And the Rainier cherries. I love the Rainier cherries. This is the only time of the year they come out but I love eating them for breakfast with some coconut milk or almond milk um, and my green tea. So I got that. And as much as I like the Fucha Tastes So Good multi-grain tortilla chips, I was not going to Costco and we needed some tortilla chips because I have some avocados and we still have salsa. So I just picked up this one, organic, restaurant style, non-GMO, give it a try. Nice big bag. We needed some tortilla chips in the house. Um, don't have anything on my Costco list yet. And then my husband loves the quiche Lorraine, so I got him that. And then they had bicolor corn on the cob, so I picked up eight of those so we can grill or something. And then I bought the bag of frozen chicken thighs, uh, the boneless skinless, which I usually get at Trader Joe's, but Trader Joe's is farther for me, so I don't go there all the time. And recently, my family's been really enjoying just putting barbecue sauce in the bag to marinate, and then we grill it. Uh, the chicken thighs, chicken breasts come out too, too dry. But I could tell you already, because I think this was $5.99 or $6.99, so about the same price as the ones from Trader Joe's, but the Trader Joe's ones is 40 ounces, where this is 32. So you are getting a little less. Um, I might just add to it because I have some frozen chicken thighs uh, store brought. Actually, no, uh, I bought some from Sprout, so you'll see it in the next one. Um, and just add it to it because we are a family of five. And then for 49 cents each, I got the sports water bottles for the summer camp and my older boys working because they keep throwing them out. That's not us. That's you. No, it's not. It's yes. someone else. So that's it. Cleaning. They throw them out. Yeah, that's it for this Whole Foods haul. And then I'll get to the Sprouts one after I put this away. And then here is the Sprouts haul that I did. Um, I actually went to Sprouts first before I went to Whole Foods. Uh, I It was the water bottles that made me go to Whole Foods. All, originally, I wasn't going to go if Sprouts had those sports water bottles, but they didn't. So... Got a lot of cool stuff from Sprouts, and I'm really excited. Um, so in the cosmetics department, I wanted to give this natural toothpaste a try, Simply Coconut Strengthening Toothpaste, uh, coconut mint, fluoride flavor. It's made with coconut oil, calcium, magnesium, and peppermint oil. And I'm hearing a lot uh, with the coconut oil pulling you swish it in your mouth. I'm hoping this kind of would be a double duty for the toothpaste since it has coconut oil. The coconut oil pulls the toxins out of your gums since your gums are very full of blood vessels. So it's a detoxifying process that you're supposed to do in the morning. You swish it around for five to 15 minutes and then spit it in your garbage. Um, I'm going to read more about this. I don't know if there's that much coconut oil that I should be concerned about clogging my sink, my drains, but I um, wanted to give this a try. Hopefully it's a double duty thing. And then also in Ayurveda, Ayurveda, they're talking about tongue scraping, that the first thing you should do in the morning is scrape your tongue before you brush your teeth, that there's a buildup on your tongue of undigested food, which is toxic, that your body digests during the middle of the night uh, in the detoxifying process while you sleep. So I wanted to try a tongue cleaner. I think this was like 
$4.99 or something like that in Sprouts. Give that a try. And then I also got some chlorophyll, chlorophyll, all these big words, geez. Uh, chlorophyll is, an, uh, what is it, the green of plants and uh, loaded with oxygen. Uh, so it's a big oxygenation source to alkaline your blood, give you uh, energy. Um, so there's a lot of benefits to chlorophyll. I had spilled mine all over the place and got some green stuff and I actually threw it out, but now I'm reading up on it again and I wanted to start it again. Just a few drops in your drinking water. This one has some mint oil in it, so you'll have a little minty flavor, um, but it's very, very good for you. Really oxygenating your blood, uh, which has so many benefits for health. And then I also got this concentrated trace minerals drops. I'm running out of the ones that I had. It's called Cell Food, and Sprouts didn't have the brand that I bought, but this one, which is actually cheaper, has pretty much the same ingredients. You know, you got magnesium chloride and sodium, which keeps your nervous system, uh, it's, it's electrolytes, it's... Um, it's basically a um, non-sugary Gatorade. A couple of drops in your drink in the morning, which I put in my lemon juice. I put some drops in there. Um, I was told that this would be beneficial for me. My muscles are very tight. Uh, probably posture, age, and stress, although I don't think I'm hugely stressed out. But then here's the, I got the Nature Tint hair dye because they were on sale. And then I wanted to try this. I saw this. I'm a big tea drinker and fan, but I do love the smell of coffee. So this one's a dandelion dark roast. And supposedly it tastes like coffee, but it's a tea. Let me see. It was on sale. Yep, see? Tastes like coffee, but steeps like a tea. So I wanted to give that a try. It is, it is decaffeinated. Naturally caffeine free, but dandelion is, oh, and it also promotes alkalinity, al alkaline balance, um, and it has probiotics. So I wanted to give this a try. Dandelion is great detoxifier, great to strengthen your liver. Your liver is your detoxification organ. It gets rid of all the garbage in your system. So um, I wanted to give that a try. And then here's another one. Uh, Tulsi Holy Basil Probiotics Peppermint and Ginger. Two of my favorite flavors. But this one's from Organic India. I do like their products. Balance to support digestive health. Um, digestive health, you know, you've been hearing a lot about the leaky gut syndrome and that all our immunity and all our health is actually coming from our gut. So let's give that one a try. And then my favorite, the orange strawberry banana juice. They have it at Sprouts. So now I don't have to haul my ass all the way to Trader Joe's when I need some. And my son's been drinking it. So I needed to restock. This is the actual juice that I go to. I do four ounces when my sugar is low and been doing it for years. So I was very upset when Whole Foods discontinued it because Trader Joe's is not close to me anymore. And it's not convenient for me to go there, uh, either during or after work, it just it becomes a really long day. So I'm really glad Sprouts has it now and it tastes exactly the same and it's organic and it's non-GMO and we're so excited about it. And then I got some ketchup, Sprouts ketchup, non-GMO. And then this looks like wine, but it's avocado oil. Upsettingly, Costco's is not carrying the avocado oil anymore. And I have to make these fried empanaditas for my sons for their work. And I do avocado oil. I don't want to buy canola or grapeseed oil. And... Yeah, they don't sell it anymore. So I was very upset. This one was on sale for $9.99. So, um, yeah, now I'm going to have to pay a little bit more for my avocado oil. And then I got these, the box lunches. My son, for his camp, loved it. I had bought two before, and he loved it so much. So I bought three for the rest of the week. Um, they have the, this one's the chicken. They have the turkey one. And this one he wanted to try. It's almond butter and jelly. So he wanted to give that one a try. 
So the only thing is, is that underneath the fruit roll up, well, not roll up, but the fruit leather, there is a box of juice. So I told him, I said, you don't need the fruit leather, which is pretty sweet, and the juice. So we actually take the fruit leather out and I keep them in my bag because I use those in case my sugar goes low as well. And then for produce, I got some baby carrots and some cauliflower because we really enjoy it and we're gonna mix it with the broccoli that we have. And then this was a great find, the Brazi Bites. They had the Parmesan and cheddar, just like the ones at Costco. Obviously, Costco, you're getting more for your money. A nice big bag. These are smaller. These were like $5 a bag. So, yeah, I spent $10 for two bags because they're tiny. But I found three cheese pizza flavor and garlic asiago. So... My boys are really excited, so that'll be a nice side for a dinner. And then these were on sale, just a little pack of beef burgers. So I bought two of those. So if we, you know, we could have to grill one night. Then the organic kids um, drinkable yogurt. I got strawberry and banana and the very berry. Um, Sean likes them for, he was using them for school, but now he has camps. And he's very active in the summer. He's always in and out, so it's a nice grab-and-go snack. And then I got a big pork loin, which I'm going to slice up into, like, pork chops and marinate them. And we're going to throw that on a grill one night. So vegetable and maybe the brazi bites can go with it uh, or a salad. So I'm going to prep that. Maybe some kind of, like, an Italian seasoning blend, like a Tuscan Italian herb blend and, you know, just some oil and let it marinate and then freeze it for when we want. And then the chicken thighs, the boneless skin is chicken thighs were on sale. And I always make sure that I find some that don't have those lines across the meat because it shows that it's old and they weren't healthy chickens. So I found two of them like that. But, um, oh, the cats are coming. Uh, so I bought two of them. And like I said, the Whole Foods frozen thighs were on the smaller side. So I might just separate this and add to the other bags. Um, but we've been really enjoying the grilled chicken thighs because they don't dry out as much. And then, get out of here, Athena. Then we, I got some chicken tenders. So I bought two packs of the chicken tenders to marinate. Um, that's nice quick meal as well. And then, this was very exciting, 100% grass-fed beef was on sale for $3.99 a pound from $5.99 a pound, which is usually the standard $5 to $6.99 a pound. So I bought two packages of that. Um, one I'm going to freeze, but the other one I actually have to make the empanaditas today for my son's jobs for tomorrow. They're having some kind of goodbye party for their supervisor. So that's it. That is the Sprouts Hall, June, mid-June, right after Father's Day. Hope you have a great day. Hope I inspired you with some ideas to have in your house for your family. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.